coming up. Well, right now, thousands of people are lacing up their sneakers and stretching their legs. The Palm Beaches Marathon Festival is today, and Ari Height joins us live from Flagler Drive, where a day of races is about to get underway. Ari? Yeah, the bike tour actually was supposed to be underway already. It was supposed to start at 6.15. That has been postponed. We're now thinking about the marathon itself may be postponed because of all the wind we have down here. A lot of debris on the road. They're trying to clear everything off before they can get things started. So before we get things started, I'm joined now by Ryan Lieber, the spokesperson for St. Mary's. Medical Center, you have some very special runners today. Tell me about that. Sure, Dr. George Paley, who's an orthopedic surgeon of the Paley Institute at St. Mary's Medical Center. This is the second year that he has brought together about 40 to 50 families of former patients that he's operated on over the year, and they are coming here to actually participate in their own walk and run here at the Marathon of the Palm Beaches. So it's pretty special because once upon a time, these kids were unable to do any of these sort of things, and now because of the limb lengthening surgeries that he performs on these children, Children, now they're able to participate. Tell me about that a little bit, if you could, please. The limb lengthening surgeries. How does that work? I don't need the specifics, obviously, of the medical part of it. Just how does that work? How does that improve their lives? Sure. Well, I mean, certainly when some of these children are born, they're unfortunately born with one leg much shorter than the other. And what Dr. Paley does is, over the course of several surgeries over several years, he can actually make both of their legs or the same length, and they can live a normal life. And certainly, it's the things that we take for granted that these kids don't have when they're growing up as a child, and thank now they're so able to do that, and they can go on and live a productive life. Ryan Lieber, thank you very much. It's a very inspirational story, one of many inspirational stories that we have already heard this morning. Again, the bike tour has already been delayed. They're talking about now delaying the marathon as well. We, of course, will be here all morning, and we will continue to bring you updates throughout the morning. That is the very latest reporting live in West Palm Beach. Ari Height, WPBF 25 News.